The M109A6 Paladin represents an advanced iteration of the M109 self-propelled howitzer, which was introduced in the early 1960s. The M109A6 Paladin was integrated into the U.S. Army's arsenal in 1991, as an upgraded version of its predecessor. Production of this self-propelled howitzer concluded in 1999, yielding a total of 950 units for deployment within the U.S. Army. Additionally, the M109A6 Paladin found its way into the arsenals of Israel and Taiwan, both of which serve as export operators. In 2021, the Pentagon greenlit the potential sale of 40 units to Taiwan. Given the discontinuation of the Crusader and NLOSC programs, the U.S. Army has continued to rely on the M109A6 Paladin artillery system. Plans are underway for its eventual upgrade to the M109A7 standard. In 2023, a significant development emerged, as 18 Paladins were designated for delivery to Ukraine, intended to bolster defense against the Russian invasion. The delivery process commenced within the same year. Distinguishing features of the M109A6 include an enlarged turret compared to its precursor. It wields the M284-155mm-L39 howitzer, equipped with a semi-automatic loading system. Its firing range spans up to 24 km using standard projectiles and extends to 30 km with rocket-assisted projectiles. A peak firing rate of 4 rounds per minute is attainable, with a sustainable pace of one round every three minutes. Several M109A6 Paladins within the U.S. Army were outfitted with modification kits to facilitate the launch of M982 Excalibur Extended Range Precision Guided Projectiles. The Excalibur, guided by GPS, boasts a remarkable range of 40 kilometers. Swift deployment capabilities allow the Paladin to halt and fire the initial round in less than a minute. Its rapid relocation capability aids in evading counter-battery fire. Supplementary armament encompasses a 12.7mm heavy machine gun affixed to the roof. In certain instances, the machine gun was substituted with a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. The M109A6 is furnished with an automated fire control system, complete with an integrated navigation and inertial positioning system. Additionally, a muzzle reference system is integrated. The Paladin's armor provides safeguarding against small arms fire and splinters from artillery shells. It is equipped with a NBC protection system, and the turret is reinforced with Kevlar anti-spall lining. Propulsion relies on the Detroit Diesel 8V71T diesel engine, generating 440 horsepower. Upgrades are planned for select Paladins, featuring a Cummins 600 horsepower diesel engine. Support for the M109A6 Paladin is delivered through the M992 ammunition supply vehicle. This transporter can accommodate up to 93 rounds and efficiently transfer them to the self-propelled howitzer using a conveyor mechanism. Variants of note include the M109A7, the latest enhancement of the Paladin. Previously referred to as the M109A6 PIM, Paladin Integrated Management, this system unveiled its first prototype in 2007. Upgraded models boast an automated loader and incorporate certain elements from the cancelled Crusader and NLOSC programs. The U.S. Army envisions an operational fleet of 580 M109A7 howitzers, accompanied by an equal number of associated armored ammunition support vehicles. Commencing with low-rate production in 2015, the full-rate production contract was signed in 2017 for the initial batch of 48 artillery systems. Distribution of these production units to the U.S. Army commenced in 2018.